Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, today we're gonna have a look at the 2014 Leisure Travel Van Serenity. Let's have a look at this unbelievable motorhome. This is one beautiful motorhome for 2014, the Serenity. Of course, it's powered by the Mercedes-Benz Sprinter cutaway chassis, 188 horsepower, 325 foot-pounds of torque. It can pull up to 5,000 pounds. It's got a five-speed transmission in it, lovely to drive. As my friends in San Diego say, it's pin quiet, Dean. You gotta love that. Let's work our way around this beautiful coach. Number one, you gotta look at all the beautiful lines. This is all fiberglass body construction. It's got great lines. It's eight feet wide, 24 feet, six inches long. It is one beautiful coach. Look at this on the Sprinter chassis. We got a locking diesel gas cap area kind of built right into the door. Nobody can mess with your diesel. I love that little feature. Here's our shore power connection. Nice and easy to hook on. And look underneath here, right here, we've got a nice little storage area. And here's our shore power cable, easy to plug in and disconnect. Great little feature. Ooh, look at those. You gotta feel these doors to really appreciate them. All aluminum, handcrafted. I love the way they lock into place. Moving down the coach here, of course, we've got our optional generator. We can go with a propane generator or a diesel generator. That is your choice. And as we work our way down some more, moving down the coach here, we've got a brand new feature for 2014. And we've got two six volt batteries, it gives you a little more amp hours. We also have a new option on the roof, a 95 watt solar panel. So if you're a dry camper, you can keep your batteries charged by the natural sunlight. That's a nice little feature, helps save the environment. Moving down the coach, of course, all of the Serenities are built on the Mercedes-Benz cutaway chassis with dual wheels. We also do some very unique things underneath. Number one, we rust-proof the chassis, that's standard. We also put sty styrofoam spray insulation around all the wheel wells and all the tanks. It keeps the unit quiet. It also prevents any damage from hitting the tanks when you're driving down the road. Very nice little feature there. As we move down the coach, we've got, our, of course, our service module, service center. On the uh, driver's side, as you can see here, we've got our exterior shower, hot and cold running water. Nice little feature to have. If you're a fisherman, you like to fish, you can clean the fish outside, you don't get that stink inside the coach. You have pets, you can wash their uh, little paws off if they're sandy going into the coach. And of course, you can have a shower outside if you want. Got easy access in for our city water fill. We've also got a remote propane fill. Another nice little feature is we got remote turn off on the propane tank, so I can just turn it off. Turn the button, propane's off. And then of course we've got our dump valves for our gray and black. This particular one has the optional macerator toilet, which is kind of a nice little feature. That'll uh, take out all the solids out of the black tank and churns them up and you can actually pump it uphill or you can pump into a little sewer center if you happen to have one in your driveway at home. Nice little feature to have. In the event that you uh, don't take the optional mass reader toilet, of course, we have the standard three inch dump system, which is very easy to do. And we also have a black water flush on the black tank, so keep that tank nice and clean. As we work around to the back of the motorhome, as you can see, once again, all fiberglass body construction. I love the lines. Once again, pin quiet to drive. We use five coats of paint, three coats of color, two coats of clear. We also, for 2014, have a new sports model edition of paint. And as we work our way back, of course, here we are with our frameless, sexy, curved glass windows. Very nice, we've got our backup camera. We've got more storage, which is great if you've got some golf clubs. You can slide them in here, lots of storage area. And we work our way down. Of course, we've got our fiberglass bumper with a steel frame inside it, integrated. We've also got a 5,000 pound receiver here, so you can tow up to 5,000 pounds, depending on how much you weigh on the coach. And we also have our connectors for pulling a trailer. We're now on the passenger side. As you can see here, we've got lots of storage area underneath the optional power sofa. We also do it with a standard corner bed. And down below, we have even more storage. Look at the size of this storage bin. Lots of room, lots of storage. Well, I wish you could feel these doors. These are unbelievable doors, beautiful doors. We work our way down. Of course, we got our frameless curved glass. And of course, once again, our dual wheels on the back. And how about some more storage? More storage. Great storage area everywhere in this coach. 
Up above, we've got our power awning. It's all enclosed in aluminum. It's called a box awning. That's a great little feature to have. That way your awning doesn't get uh, beat up by the sun or damage when you're driving down the road. And it's power, and it's very simple to use. What a great power awning. Seven feet in width, and we're over 12 feet in length. And let me show you how easy this is. Drop this down, set your height. Second side over here, same thing. We have a beautiful calm day today. So on a day like today, I would just use tent pegs and I would tent peg the uh, awning down. But if it was blowing, blustery, a little bit of wind out there, I can lock it right into place right here. So built-in anchors right into the motorhome. Now the wind's not going to uh, move the awning at all. Plus for 2014, we've added LED lights to the awning. How perfect is this? Built-in LED lights in my awning. Yeah, I love it. On the Serenity, of course, we use the Mercedes-Benz swivels. Look how easy this is to swivel. I don't think there's an easier swiveling seat available on any chassis. Plus, we do a nice little feature here we carpet our entire cab area and we use a rubber backing area. That way when you're moving in and out, it doesn't slide around. Plus, underneath this carpet, look at this, built-in Mercedes-Benz toolkit. This motorhome has so many unique little features, you have to see one in person. For example, look at this, curved entrance door. All fiberglass, curved glass, that is beautiful. Plus, look at this, hidden screen door. How beautiful is that? If you think the outside's impressive, come on inside. Let's have a look at the 2014 Serenity inside. Of course, we're just in the chassis area and I love how Leisure Travel Vans has incorporated the chassis into the motorhome. Of course, up front here, we've got 188 horsepower, V6 motor, turbo diesel by Mercedes-Benz, five-speed Mercedes transmission. We've got all the features of home with the air conditioning, power windows, power locks, tilt steering. We look at the panoramic view. There's no tunnel. A lot of motorhomes have a big hangover on the front end of it. You can't see like driving in a tunnel. This is nice and wide open. I can see everywhere. I can see my lake. I can see my forest. I can see everything. Of course, up front, we've got our in-dash entertainment center. We've got a GPS system on it. We've got uh, AM, FM. It plays movies. It plays movies on the back TV. We've also got Bluetooth. We've also got um, streaming Bluetooth, a Sirius radio. So it does a little bit of everything and it does a lot of a lot of things. A couple little switches down low. This is our radio control switch. So what happens with this switch is that all of our uh, power that we need for our stereo system comes from the house batteries. We never pull from the chassis battery, so make sure that green light is on. And our camera, if you have a tow vehicle, you hold the button down and it'll flash what your tow vehicle is doing in behind you. And of course, we have a little feature here. If you have this optional stabilizer jacks down, the light will be on. And uh, if you accidentally turn on the motor with the jacks down, the jacks automatically come up. Nice little safety feature there. Let's work our way back in the coach. Of course, up front here on our driver and passenger seats, they incorporate into the house, which is a great feature to have. Of course, all done in ultra leather. If you don't have ultra leather, pass. This is a beautiful product. Doesn't get hot, doesn't get cold, doesn't crack, easy to clean. And look at this, French stitching on all the upholstered items. Very nice. We also do memory foam in all of the seat cushions. As you can see, our two chairs incorporate for dinner, so you can have dinner for four or five people at our, at our dining room table. And as you know, this is the kind of the world famous dining room table, where it'll go in any direction you want. Move it around for playing cards, dinner, great little feature. For 2014, we've done the tabletop in cherry wood or maple, because we offer two different interior wood colors, solid cherry or solid maple. This one, of course, is done in solid cherry wood. And this also makes into a bed area. So if you have grandchildren or you have some friends over or some uninvited friends, you have a, a 48 by 82 inch bed. And I'm gonna show you how that makes into a bed right away. Very simple to make into a bed. First, we just push our table down. We just lock it in place. We then bring out this piece of wood, move our cushions out of the way. We bring this over, put all the cushions in place. 48 by 82 inch bed, all done in memory foam, ultra leather, super comfortable. Yes, super comfortable. 
We go from a bed back to a dining room area, and this is how simple this is. This table will slide right out of the way, so I have easy access from the driver's area back into the motorhome. First, well, obviously, if this isn't the most beautiful cabinetry work you've ever seen, I don't know what is, but have a look at this curved wood, solid wood, you know, unbelievably strong. I love that. Dual struts so it doesn't hit you in the back of the head. European hinges, great lock system, and look at the cabinetry that you have. Tons of cabinets in the back. Beautiful cabinetry work. You have to see a Serenity in person. Open and close all the doors. When you're looking at buying any motorhome, you should open and close all the doors. Another great feature on the Serenity, of course, is our built-in skylight. And it is raining a little bit right now, but it opens all the way up, gives you lots of fresh air. Plus, if you have some mosquitoes or bug issues, you can put out the screen right across, or for privacy at night, perfectly dark. Another new feature for 2014, we've added some coat hooks. So when you come into your motorhome, you can hang up your jackets. Of course, we've got uh, LED lights throughout the entire coach. We've got a little dimmer switch here, which is nice for mood lighting. And as we work our way over here, look at this. Big hanging closet so you can hang up your jackets or, or other hanging clothes when you come in. Of course, all done in cherry wood or maple. And down here, we've got a place to put your shoes so the shoes aren't in the step well. You won't fall out of them when you're getting in and out of your motorhome. If we work our way over to this side, nice new feature for 2014. Customers requested it. We did it. Of course, we have MCD shades. How beautiful is that? Hey, we're now in the gallery area. Let's go way down low in the gallery area. Have a look at this. Beautiful curved doors, solid cherry wood, European hinges. Look at this, pull out pot and pan drawer. Very, very nice. Working our way over this. Oh, a little reverse curved door. I love that. Oh, what have we got in here? Tell me it isn't so. Pull out pantry. Love that, love it. If you're a cooker, this is the unit. Drawers, full slide out, extended drawers, solid wood. We're in the galley area right now and you can see what a beautiful galley area, lots of room for cooking. If you love to cook, you can cook all day on this galley. Two burner stove, spark ignition. Of course, we've got a built-in garbage can. Look at this, solid Corian countertops, private collection. This is the top of the line Corian and it's in a Serenity. Plus look at this, deep stainless steel sink. And of course, you need a cutting board. We have one built right in. We're on the other side of the galley area. Of course, we got our convection microwave. Very nice. It uh, does everything from cooking chickens to making pizza to making bread to popping popcorn. So beautiful convection microwave. And of course, we've got our three-way Dometic fridge, 6.1 that turns into a seven cubic foot fridge, 12 volt, 110 and propane. It's pretty darn big. Look at this. How do you want to make it into a bigger fridge? Let me show you. The freezer pops out. Voila. All refrigerator. Great if you're just day camping, going to a uh, tailgating party, carry a few extra drinks in there. As everyone knows, I have a bit of an emotional attachment to pull out pantries. The Serenity has one down low and hello, one up high. Full size pantry. You gotta love that. Plus down low, a little more storage. Perfect. Down low, we're down low again. Look at this, pull out drawers, full extension drawers, steel, ball bearing. Oh, look at that. Nice big drawers. Plus we got a nice dressing mirror. Oh goodness, who, who put white pants on me today? As you can see here, we've got our service center, nicely hidden, and we've got all of our control centers right here. So we have our optional stabilizer jacks. They help stabilize the coach. They're all electric. Of course, we've got our 600 watt inverter that'll run your TVs and your entertainment systems. We have our optional generator, either propane or diesel, and it's easy to start right here. And then we've got our monitor system, and we use a sonar system, so it tells us exactly what percentage of the tank is full. So we have fresh, gray, black, and of course our propane, also our battery, water heater. We have an optional tankless water heater system this year, or the standard electric gas hot water tank. And we've also got our water pump system right there. 
Plus, these two buttons are for our optional electric sofa in the back, and let me just show you how that works. This is how easy it is to make this into a bed. That's how easy that is. 55 inches by 82 inch bed. How perfect is that? All done in memory foam, all done in ultra leather, French stitching. I have tons of room. I can sleep this way, I can sleep this way. Tons of room for sleeping. On the Serenity, we also have standard, a corner bed with a six inch Sealy mattress, which is very comfortable for those of you that just wanted this to be a full-time bed all the time. When you do it with the optional electric sofa, it kind of gives you two living areas, front and back, and you've got a nice little privacy area here. So if you want to watch TV in the back and read a book up front, and of course, if you want to watch TV up front, how sweet is this? New bigger TV swings all the way forward so I can watch TV in the front and I can have a little nap in the back, not a problem. I love all the windows that we have in the Serenity. If you can see, look out, you can see the lake area here. It's beautiful. This is curved glass and I love these, these uh, windows. They open up so that if it was raining out just now, which it was, no rainwater comes in and I got screens on there so no bugs can bug me. I like that. Solid wood balances and of course, new for 14 MCD shades. So we got a little bit of daytime and then of course privacy at night. Great feature to have. All LED lights throughout. Beautiful, and look at these cabinets. Tons more storage space. And a little more storage up here, hidden storage, beautiful. Love this, this is just a great living area, bedroom area, dual functional. Have a look up, of course, we've got our beautiful 15,000 BTU air conditioner with a built-in heat pump. It's also ducted throughout the coach, so you get air flowing throughout the entire coach. A lot of motorhomes only have the air in one spot. We flow the air everywhere we can. Most companies, when they talk about their vans, they don't like to talk about the bathroom, but we're gonna talk about the bathroom in the Serenity because it's beautiful. Three-piece dry bath. I don't have to sit on this toilet to have a shower. I can stand up and have a shower. And as you know, I'm between 6'1 and 6'3. I'm growing. As I get older, I'm still growing. So I got lots of room to shower. Hey, have a look at this. What a beautiful toilet. Residential size, China toilet. Underneath the sink, we've got a beautiful vanity and we've got for 2014 full water filtration on all the water. Undermount sink, oh, very nice. And look at this, built-in medicine cabinet, all wood. And of course, a window with a shade. If you're looking for one great motorhome, you wanna travel, see all of North America, and you wanna be small, 24 feet, six inches, something a little bit wider, you want a hybrid touring sedan RV, the Serenity is the one. If you haven't seen one, go to your nearest leisure travel van dealer, take one out for a drive. You are gonna be so impressed with this motorhome. Dean from Leisure Travel Vans.